This gives us an opportunity to get out into the, the community and, and make a difference. It's um, something that we're all very proud of. The response has been brilliant. I mean, it really has, from all levels as well. It's good job satisfaction when you look back at what you've done. The kids are just going to be over the moon with us. I can't believe that we're getting all this done all at the one time. We work for a sister company of Doosan Babcock, which is Doosan Empire. It's the two sides of the business coming together to do some good in the communities in which we're both situated. It's not just about um, offering people work, it's about the value of that job and the value that you put back into the community locally that, that, that really makes a difference. The staff reaction has been absolutely fantastic to be honest. Volunteers all over the country, all over the world getting involved in, in these programmes and uh, they really have responded with a great deal of enthusiasm. It's so fabulous seeing our people. Our people have got so much talent and enthusiasm. But the important thing is the planning that's gone into this. This has been planned for the last three months and we've just got people with the right spirit, the right culture, and they're doing things that do sound way. The staff response to this has, has been excellent. This is our second event. The numbers have actually doubled in terms of volunteers this time round. In Doosan Babcock, today there'll be over 850 people involved in the Doosan Day of Community. Today we are doing several maintenance jobs and gardening for a, a local special needs school. It's important that we spread the word of Dusan, so to speak, within the local community and ensure that we, we're not just an employer, we, we do care about other aspects of the community. What we are doing here today is helping the, uh, the local community in the Campus Hub area in a big way. This is all that we've been working on. The floors are all rotten and over the last four days we've replaced all the, all the joists, all the wooden floors. And I think what we're doing today is going to raise a profile that, that, you know, that we are here, not just to work on the power stations, etc., but to help where we can. Well, the experience was a, a good one. Uh, we fully enjoyed it, like, and we've got some feedback from a, a local who was passing by this morning, actually, and uh, it was all very pleasing over the moment with the uh, work that had been carried out. So there was, that was good to hear, really, so it was very good. Today's experience has been very, very positive. This job here at Oosfleet Play Park would have taken the green team two or three days. With the volunteers that we've got from Doosan, uh, we'll get this done in a day, I'm very confident. And the benefits to the community will be huge. Today we're um, painting a gym and a dancing studio in the YMCA in West Bromwich area. Well, we had a very, very good amount of volunteers from Tipton but needing special mention I think are the apprentices because virtually the entire year volunteered. It's exceptional to see. Today secondary school students are coming in and basically being taught the basics of what we're being taught just to give them a little idea of what we're doing. I think the work we do here with the, with the school children allows us to get out to a much wider audience uh, in the local schools and hopefully people will be applying for jobs with us in the future. Well, this particular school is, is closer to my heart because my own children went to the school and, and as did I and I just obviously approached the school to see if they needed any work doing. People can actually see that somebody is providing something free of charge um, not, not just the materials and equipment but also free labour uh, employees whether they're apprentices or, or staff are willing to put their time and effort in uh, and um, you know bring something worthwhile to the community. I, I think it's a fantastic thing I think I think that the fact that the that Doosan as a, a global organization is willing to put this much effort and time into this it is fantastic. Today we've got a, a football tournament um, for school children um, with learning disabilities. Um, so there'll be uh, lots of matches going on and we've got volunteers from uh, Doosan to help referee and, and help out. Doosan is not just a company about making money, making profits, it's about giving back and being part of something bigger. But what today rather has been really good about is seeing teamwork in action by the second, by the minute. It shows we care, it 
shows our staff that we care. It's great team building, great teamwork for our staff. It gets people excited and people have been excited about today. All of these projects uh, will help the local community for, for a number of years. And this isn't just a one-off. These events uh, take place every six months within Doosan, so it's part of a continuous process. As a charity, we you know, very much dependent on people's generosity and uh, people like these guys, when they're prepared to come along and do something for us, is just fantastic. But I think doing something like this to make their lives a bit, a bit easier, happier, it gives you a, a sense of achievement. <laughs> We've got some lovely people from Doucet um, who've come to pay the doors for us. Uh, very grateful. We're always very grateful when companies in the area engage with us and offer help like they have today. I think it's very important to understand you know, what goes on in the community. I had no idea this place existed or that it had the need for this, so it opens your eyes to a, a, something that is very important and that you're just unaware of. We're refurbishing the garden of the Craigley Care Home. Um, it's very close to our office, you can see we're only a couple of hundred yards away. Um, we've got a, a special kind of relationship with the care home, arising from a, a member of my team whose father was looked after here. The family were very complimentary, so it was the ideal opportunity to give a little back. It means the absolute world to us. Um, to have anybody coming and volunteering and helping us sort out the garden is amazing, but especially something where it's big structural works like laying of paths to allow wheelchair access to the patios that we've got. So yes, it's, it's going to really make the garden a splendid place to sit in. We've been working closely with Renfrewshire Food Bank to provide some additional warehouse storage facility which they're badly in need of. It's important for a company like ours to have strong community ties and something like the, the Renfrewshire Food Bank allows us to have sustainable ties. This is something that we want to work with the Renfrewshire uh, Food Bank with uh, going forward so that we're not just giving them a food bank but we can do things together going forward to make sure that we can improve upon the facility that they have here. It's very important for the company to get involved in the local community and give something back to the to the culture and the fabric of, of the environment that it operates in. Now, a lot of the, lot of some of the guys who are on this team today actually came to school here, yep. so they're they're seeing the kind of full thing coming back to kind of uh, help create the new space and the new school. So it's a good good thing for them. It's a great feeling, especially it's as local as it can get. The school's right on the doorstep from our work. So it's a very good feeling to actually contribute something yeah. back. This is actually part of my local community. So when, they, when I heard there's a cherry sitting and I want to get involved in it. It's giving a wee bit back to the community. In the 40 odd years we have never had anything in a scale like this happen to us before. Um, we have a, a, a bit of funding here and there, but nothing in this scale. We couldn't even begin to do the job that they are doing here the day. have made it a safer, a better. I can't even thank you enough. There's not enough words and it's better than winning the lottery for me. Oh. So thanks very much for that.